My God is so big and so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big and so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big and so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big and so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God of Kids Club Anywhere, we're talking about how Jesus is really, really powerful. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. We're going to talk about Jesus. Why? Because he's so powerful. How powerful is he? More powerful than these pretty balloons. Exploded! Don't drill us at home. Okay, so if you know nothing about Jesus being powerful, here's a few things that might be helpful. Jesus is really powerful, like really super duper powerful. Powerful enough that he could speak to a raging thunderstorm and make it quiet just by talking to it. Powerful enough to turn water into wine. Powerful enough to take a few fish and a couple loaves of bread and feed 5,000 people with it. Powerful enough to heal sick people like a blind man and a man who hadn't walked in more than 30 years. But even more powerful, Jesus took the punishment for all of our wrong choices so that we don't have to. He did it by dying on a cross. And the most powerful thing he ever, ever did was that he didn't stay dead. He beat death. And that is a little bit about Jesus' power. This next story, we're not using any words. And that starts Okay. 
things all around us. We see them and experience them every day. Whether it's the wind in the air or the waves of the ocean. We see them in people too, in the boxer's punch or the acrobat's flip. You know, there's actually something or someone that's more powerful than all of those things. And his name is Jesus. Jesus wants to share his power with us. He wants us to experience his power. He wants to give it to us. And one of the best ways that we can access Jesus' power is by trusting Him. You know, I think in my own life of times where I felt like I wasn't measuring up or I didn't have enough. I had to rely on Jesus' power, whether it was me trying out for a sports team and I didn't think I had what it took or being hurt by someone that I cared about. Jesus would show up time and time again and help me have the effort and the energy I needed to give my best. Maybe there's areas in your life where you could use some of Jesus' power. Maybe you're going to a new school and you're hoping to find new friends fast. Maybe you're trying out for a sports team and you're hoping that you can make the team or at least show up and give it your all. Ephesians 6.10 tells us, finally, let the Lord make you strong. Depend on His mighty power. So let's do that right now. Let's depend on God's power. Let's ask Him into the areas of our lives where we feel like we're not measuring up. And we can do that through a simple prayer that sounds like this. Hey God, I'm struggling in some things in my life and I really would love it if you would show up. Help me out in those areas. Give me your power. Allow me to fully experience everything that you have for me. Amen. On this episode of Kids Club Anywhere, we talked about how Jesus is really powerful and that he wants us to experience that power too. Give it a try and see how it goes. And subscribe for more Kids Club Anywhere.